Hey guys, I'm back. First, I wanted to apologize because in my last video I told you I would show you Rome, uh, but things didn't really go to plan. We landed very late and then with the crew, uh, we decided to go for a pizza because, of course, it's Italy. Uh, I have to say I didn't really have the energy in the morning to wake up early. So I apologize for that, but you know what, I'm sure we'll be back. But you know what, guys? Today I am in Mexico City. Uh, so I'm very excited. Basically, I was on the home standby today. And when you're on home standby, uh, you wait at home and if they need you for duty, uh, they call you out and basically you have two hours to get ready and go to the airport for your duty. So yeah, I have a five days trip to Mexico, which is very rare, very unusual. Um, it's a very long trip, three nights at the hotel. Plenty of time to rest, enjoy the city, discover the city. So it's like a mini holidays, really. I'm not too sure yet what I'm gonna do, but one thing is sure is that you gonna follow me during this trip. So yeah, just stay tuned and let's go. See you tomorrow. I've always wanted to do that for some reason, so now, let's go! Hola amigos! So today I've decided to go to visit the historic center of Mexico. Obviously, Mexico City has a very rich history. It was the capital of the Aztec, uh, and then they had the uh, Spanish conquest, and they gained again their independence in the 19th century. So let's go to see uh, the main monuments, the history of the city. I have to catch a quick metro, which is just there. Uh, and I see you there. Follow me. I've just arrived to the main square of uh, Mexico City. Uh, it's called La Plaza de la Constitución or Zucato as well. It's a massive square. They organize always big events in here. Uh, they call it as well the, um, uh, the Army Square. You have as well the residence of the president, which is just here. It's called la, uh, El Palacio Nacional. The president's making uh, some speeches from uh, this uh, this terrace there and just next to the palacio you have a gorgeous cathedral the metropolitan cathedral just here and yeah as you can see it's a big square but first uh, let's go to the roots of the history of mexico city uh, mexico city was the aztec uh, capital and there is a ruin just uh, right there. So let's have a look. So this is a ruins of Templo de Mayor. Uh, so it was the, uh, the the capital of the Mexica people. We call them as well Aztec. It was built in the 13th century, and it was the um, the place where all the political, um, religious, and economic decisions were made. Um, so on top of the, um, it was a big pyramid, on top of it, it there was two temples, one for the god of war and the other one for the god of rain and um, agriculture. When the Spaniards conquered the city in the 16th century, they destroyed the whole city and they used the stones to build this magnificent uh, cathedral just there. They wanted to evangelize uh, the, the indigenous people uh, and that's why they built this massive cathedral there. So this is the Metropolitan Cathedral. So the real name is actually, so bear with me, it's very short. So it's Catedral Metropolitana de la Asunción de la Santisama Virgen Maria a los Cielos. <laughs> so yeah, very, very short. Uh, it was built in two parts. The first part there was built in the 16th century and the other part was built later in the 18th century. And it has a Gothic, Gothic styles and inside you 
can see a massive oak org, and it's actually the biggest org in uh, Latin America. So what you have to know about uh, Mexico City is that it was built in between volcanoes. Uh, so there are a lot of earthquakes here. Uh, it was built as well over a lake. Uh, the legend say, says that uh, the Aztec gods told its people uh, that wherever they will find, they will have this vision of an eagle eating a snake with his uh, left claw on a cactus, it will become the secret city. So they were looking for it for like 50 years and one day they saw uh, that vision in a little island on this lake, it's called the Lake Texcoco. And, uh, so they built the city uh, on this island. Uh, later, when the Spaniards uh, con conquered uh, the country, they uh, wanted to extend the city and they wanted to fight the floods, so they drained completely uh, this, uh, this lagoon, this lake. So it was a bit of an ecological disaster uh, because indeed a lot of uh, indigenous species uh, it was uh, instinct and uh, a lot of drought as well. And um, what is important to know as well is that today uh, the city is sinking. So every year uh, the city is sinking by five centimeters. It's quite a lot. That's why if you walk around Mexico City, uh, you will see a lot of buildings uh, leaning. Um, so it's going to be a problem in a few decades or centuries. Uh, but there is not much uh, they can do. So 
I've just experienced uh, an Aztec ritual. Uh, basically, is to cleanse your body. It's a purification. Uh, so it's to take all the bad spirits out of your body, all the bad energy. I have to say, I feel pretty relaxed now. I'm not sure if it works, but I feel very good. That's good. Do it.